Good morning, I'm Julie Chin. Here's a look at some of today's top stories from Two Works For You. Happening today, COVID-19 restrictions are loosening across the state. Starting today, there will be no restrictions on events. Governor Kevin Stitt making the announcement in a news conference this week. He is also removing the requirements to wear masks in state buildings. Our state has administered 1,340,818 doses of COVID vaccine to Oklahomans. Governor Stitt saying we are on track to get our summer back. Meanwhile, the Oklahoma Department of Corrections has begun vaccinating its most vulnerable inmate population. It received its first batch of vaccines from the state health department Tuesday and started administering them as soon as possible. The first to get a dose of the vaccine inmates within infirm infirmaries. Inmates with comorbidities and those 65 and older are also getting shots. Now let's get a look at your forecast with meteorologist Annie Brown. Thanks, Julie, and good Friday morning. Yes, we're tracking the potential for a isolated stronger storm to develop. Marginal risks set in place. We'll get a little bit of a break this afternoon, so that's your window to get any errands done because we'll see those chances increasing with highs for today. 70s to the south and 60s, even a few 50s to the north. High tomorrow, 72. Those showers and storms continuing into Sunday. Julie. Thanks, Annie. We know you'll keep an eye on things. And a reminder to tune in this Sunday for two special shows and a town hall. Starting at 6 o'clock, join Vincent Hill and Karen Larson for a special edition of Two Works for You. Then at 7, the special Hidden Bias of Good People. Afterward, join us for a town hall discussion on bias with Green Country leaders. You can send in your questions ahead of time to the email address on your screen. That's a look at some of the stories making headlines today. Stay with Two Works for You for updates throughout the day. Have a great day.